What's up, everyone? Uh, this is uh, a simple demo of, uh, of this synthesizer. This is the output it's going to to the amplifier. Uh, I'm using a guitar amp it's right here uh, for my output. Uh, <coughs> so basically, it has a voltage-controlled filter. It has a low-frequency oscillator. It has a white noise noise source. That's sequencer envelope and uh, the VCA voltage controlled controlled amplifier. But this one I didn't have space for it in the box, so that's why it's, it is here. So <coughs> first demonstrate. This is what the low frequency oscillator sounds like. It is a voltage source, but uh, kind of oscillates. Yeah, at low frequencies. Basically, you can change the yeah. So I also have a white noise, white noise source. That sounds like uh, just radio static, you know. It, same here and here. Yeah. Uh, <coughs> I also have a voltage-controlled filter. This is the output. Uh, I'm going to put it in, <coughs> in oscillation. <coughs> Basically, it's a filter, but uh, it can oscillate on its own, you no? Know? And you can change the frequency. Uh, that is the resonance, you know, and. Uh, Excuse me, I'm having a bit of cough. But uh, <coughs> there are two voltage sources so far that I have on this module. <coughs> Actually, there are three. I have a low frequency oscillator, I have an envelope at the extreme end, and I have a sequencer. So all of this can affect either the frequency or the amplitude of the signal that's going through. So, for example, <coughs> I'm going to show you the amplitude modulation of the VCA with the low frequency oscillator. Apart from the low frequency oscillator, we can do the same thing with uh, the sequencer. But the sequencer has uh, more control because it has, my sequencer has eight steps. You can adjust the rate. You can make it go faster through the steps. You can make it go really fast, as you can see through. You can make it go slow. Or you can switch the steps uh, to four. With these switches, uh, now it is switching through four steps and you know going back going back and right here it's sending out control voltages so we're going to control the vol voltage controlled amplifier with the voltage from the sequencer here yeah, what that sounds like <coughs> <coughs> thing we can control is uh, a control voltage is uh, the envelope now <coughs> this is the output of the envelope an envelope just basically <coughs> defines the attack and the release of a musical note percussive uh, musical elements uh, they normally have a faster attack and fast release 
while most are staining, you know, like strings, like piano and all that, those sounds, they have a, um, a softer attack and softer release. So, <coughs> the envelope uh, also has its own controls. It has the attack and the decay and has an output control <coughs> and has a manual gate and external gate. So, you can use the this button to actually, you know, trigger the manual gate and as it triggers the gate, you know, it should affect the sound that's coming through. Mm. Every time the, uh, this sends out a control voltage, the envelope sends out an attack and decay uh, envelope which controls, you know, the sustain and release of the notes. So, uh, Every time I press this key or this uh, button, I trigger the frequency of, you know, of the VCF, and it's, it's what you're hearing basically. <coughs> but then another interesting thing is that we can do what I'm doing to trigger the envelope with a low frequency oscillator or with a sequencer. So. Uh, <coughs> I'll get another cable to demonstrate that. <coughs> okay, so <coughs> now it's becoming a little bit more complicated. Our sound source is the VCF, which is right now oscillating. The VCF is being controlled by the low frequency oscillator, but the low frequency oscillator is also sending out a control voltage to the envelope generator. And uh, <coughs> And the low frequency oscillator is also sending on a trigger to the VCA. So the VCA is reacting to the low frequency oscillator and the envelope is also reacting to the um, low frequency oscillator. So you can see uh, that that showing the reaction and the VCA. So what does that sound like? Mm -hmm. Basically, you can create uh, sweeps 